how long? Have pity on your servant. Yes. Satisfy us in the morning with your steadfast love, Amen. that we may rejoice and be glad all our days. Amen. Make us glad for as many days as you have afflicted us, and for as many years as we have seen evil. Amen. Amen. Um, I was a pastor for six years, and you have been a pastor till now, as a father to them. And, uh, so every sin and anything that concerns them, it's always a priority for me, it's because they have um, earned it by the way of their life, by the, life, by the way of their commitment, and they were grateful to God. This, is a, this hope is a birthday gift. Hallelujah. And it has not come by accident, even around when we are at least praying and you know, prayers have been offered here, but we're doing it, you know, as as a multiple stream of celebrations this morning. It's our prayer that this will be the least that God will do for you. Amen. We have to be gone. This is a start up. And we're grateful that God has taken you away from the crowd. You know. The, the crowd of uh, the Kusio, <laughs> where, 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 where you wake up in the morning is the Omalata you first meet, <laughs> able to search a, a three-fold a, a three protection area that God has brought you. You, know, you have this new place, you have your zone, you have Makoto Estate. I'll give you a threefold, but above all, the Bible says the name of the Lord is a strong tower. Yes. The righteous one in the evening. Now, Pastor Loret says, So teach us to number our days. So you need to continually number your days. That is, every time you, you, you retire to bed, ask yourself, How productive have that day been? How, how wasteful the day had been, and how will God account it for you unto righteousness or unto you know, sin? So I pray that the Lord will continue to teach you Amen. to number your days in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's thank God for what the Lord has done in their lives. Let's thank God for the journey of life so far. How far God has brought them. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. Blessed be your name, O God. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. Amen. The story was told of a young lady who attended a choir practice on Saturday. And by Sunday morning, she had posted on her, on her page. Thank God for me, I just arrived in through. <laughs> she was at the rehearsal. <laughs> and then Sunday morning she put on her on her on her page. She said, Thank God for me, I just arrived in through. And so I said, Well, that is the kind of thing. But and yet people are still buying houses. And a young man is still buying a house of this nature. Anyone who buys a house in my good old knows that he's buying is by God. Let's thank God who makes all things even above, above, above towards us. Let's thank God who, who therefore we dedicate this home unto the, unto the almighty God in the name of God the Father. Amen. In the name of God the Son. Amen. In the name of God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Every room of this of this home is blessed. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Every room will carry the presence of the living God. Amen. For protection. Amen. For provision. Amen. For safety. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. 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 Thank you, Father.
I finish that food. I'll try. Okay, I found your photo for you, Mr. Yeah, Brown. This is drop food now. You want to follow our photo? <laughs> Technically, it's our money. The post gonna take off this. Mr. Brown, please, it's okay. Yeah, it's 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 it